It is a fact that sinus problems, medically known as sinusitis, can cause significant high blood pressure amongst many patients. Though, it is necessary to have a considerable understanding of sinusitis so we can work out the relationship between sinusitis and hypertension. Many of those people affected by sinus issues are well aware of the fact that their sinus conditions can trigger major headaches and congestion as well. It creates a significant probability for many patients to suffer from high blood pressure too. But, the question is why and how? Taipei Medical University even conducted a new study that inflammation can cause considerable pressure and pain related to the sinus infection. It can also increase significant odds for many, high-risk, vulnerable patients suffering from a stroke. The high frequency of blood pressure can increase the risk of stroke amongst a large number of patients. Chronic and recurrent sinusitis can even have more severe implications for patients. Thus, in this article, I am going to provide a detailed analysis to address our primary question. Can sinus problems cause high blood pressure? The link of sinusitis with high blood pressure and stroke, as a complication, reflects the heightened risk to many adults in their midlife and after. About 37% of the high blood pressure patients have a high stroke risk, in the age bracket between 45 and 65 years. The same viruses, and bacteria in some cases, lead to sinus infections across a large number of patients, have experienced common cold just before sinusitis are together. It happens when a virus infects sinuses in a person, and it also easily could lead to inflammation, which causes the telltale pressure around the eyes and nose. The infections can get resolved within a duration of 7 or 10 days. In around 2% of the cases, the disease does not manifest in this particular time duration. It is an indication that an infection has progressed to a secondary bacterial infection, that would require antibiotics to control and suppress better. The irritation is indeed quite high for the patients when they have a constant need to clearing up their nose. Inflammation can surely be a stroke trigger for many patients suffering from severe sinus problems, especially if they are aged and have heart, vessel, or blood clotting problems. For addressing the risk, it is necessary to take steps in taming chronic inflammation in the nasal passages, especially in people with hypertension and stroke risk. In case of a situation, if the sinus irritation would last longer than a week in any person, then he must visit a doctor.